Hi everyone, this is Marianne and welcome to my channel. Today I just want to share with you my thoughts about this laptop stand that I have been using for over two months now. I purchased this from Lazada and I will leave a link down below. My sister has this and she was the one who told me to buy it. She uses it to turn her regular desk into a standing desk, but I use this so that I can study and work on my thesis in bed. You can see here how I have set up my dorm bed to be my study area. <laughs> I have a video about how I have made my dorm bed more comfortable and I will leave the link down below. But this is the laptop stand itself. The tray is made of metal with a black matte finish and it has round holes in it that act as vents for the dissipation of heat and I will show you that later. I think that the strongest feature of this laptop stand is its legs. The legs are jointed. There are only two legs and each leg has three different moving parts and three joints. And each joint has a round button that we can press to move the leg parts around and each button has these numbers around it. These are the markers for the degree to which each leg part is angled at any given time, which is being pointed to by this little black arrow. As you can see, I have the actual tray tilted at an angle and the marker shows that I have it at an angle that is one notch to the right of the zero. Let me show you how to work this laptop stand. First of all, it comes to you this way with the legs completely folded up and this is also how the laptop can be stored. Notice the round circles that act as vents which I mentioned earlier. And then you simply press the button on the joint that you want to adjust and it's very easy to get the exact angle because the buttons click when the joints get to each angle that corresponds to each notch in the marker and the leg part locks into place. You can't move it any further unless you press the button again. That way you don't have to second guess the settings of the joints so to speak and all of the joints and both of the legs are perfect calibrated to match. It's very precise. Now I will let you listen to the clicks as you watch me manipulate the legs of the laptop stand. If you press and hold the button though, you can practically swing the leg part further without it locking into place. But if you are unsure of the angle, just let it lock into place and check the markers to see if you have it at an angle that matches the angle on the other leg. Another convenient feature of the legs is that the last leg part has a hole that you can push your finger through if you want to press the button of the next joint without having to swing out the leg part on top out of the way first. So that explains these geeky little things that you see here on the laptop stand. The legs, by the way, are made of metal and the joints and buttons are made of a dense hard plastic. It also came with a tiny little tray for a mouse and screws to attach the mouse tray to the stand but it wasn't the right angle and it was kind of useless so I threw it away but I already used the trackpad most of the time so I didn't really need that mouse tray. Because the joints are completely adjustable, you can adjust the tilt of the tray itself. For me, this angle is the most comfortable. It's the correct angle for me to type in when I am reclining and also the correct angle for when I am sitting in a lotus position. And it's also easy to move around in bed. Just grip it on both sides of the tray and lift. When I am reading, like right now, reclining on the bed, I place the stand a little bit further down the bed and then when I need to type in my notes or ideas, I just sit up and type. I'm using Write Room for distraction free writing and I will leave a link for it down below. I really like this laptop stand. I did not need such a stand when I was using my 11 inch MacBook Air for seven years because that laptop was very light and very small and it had a solid state hard drive which hardly ever heats up because there are no moving parts inside. But now I'm on a 15 inch MacBook Pro which is heavy and it gets too hot to place on my lap sometimes. And I am a bed lover and I tend to stay up longer 
working on my thesis compared with when I am staying up late upright at my desk for some reason. There's just so much ground to cover with my thesis and I am on a deadline so study tools that help me stay up and comfortable are really necessary. I highly recommend this product. Of course, you don't have to use it just for bed. You can use it on your work desk and turn it into a standing desk like my sister does. Or you can just keep it there on top of your desk but all folded up so it can act as a sort of platform for your laptop for heat dissipation and to keep the laptop dry in case something spills on your desk. And you can also use it for reading in bed if the book is too heavy. Just place a book stand on top of it instead of a laptop. And that's it for my review. I hope you like this and leave me a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, please comment down below and I will get to it as soon as I can. Thanks for watching. Bye!